So, uh, we got quite a bit milled up today. We did get uh, quite a bit of walnut done, some maple done. Got my revenge on the maple tree that damn near killed me. Well, I ended up with a log on my foot over the deal, but close enough near death experience anyway. Um, we ended up cutting up some really nice cedar here, which is just, that stuff's gorgeous. Um, we got a bunch of nice natural edge stuff. That's sassafras right there. More maple here. Um, I said, there's all nat the natural edge stuff. Nice piece of cedar natural edge, some walnut natural edge, and then all the maple. And this big bastard right here is the one that did the, indeed end up on my foot. So that there's going in a special place. But uh, we're running cedar right now. Um, got, I think dad's off this week, so he's gonna run some while I'm gone because he's a little bitty stuff. He can do this by himself. Uh, my uncle's taking all the firewood off of these, the slab lumber. So that's actually where, just where I came from is over at his house, dropping off a load of slab. Um, but we got some really nice cedar here. We're gonna get it all knocked out. Um, I mean, what we've been doing, leaving the forks sit here, load the forks up with slab and just dump it on the bed. And we have to hand take it off over my uncle's, but it's been working out pretty good. Um, I said, I think dad's gonna work on some, some so he's set up to go tomorrow. I uh, got the mill all sir, ready to go. We went through it, greased it, everything, checked it over, put a new blade on today. Just, we spent Saturday working on everything. You know, we had some maintenance stuff that needs to be done and greasing everything and uh, organizing stuff here in this barn because it's been an organizational nightmare, but we're getting her cleaned up. Um, but it's winter. I'm waiting on my truck to warm up before I get back in it because it's about as cold in there as it is out here. So I'd soon stand out here and do a video and sit in there and freeze my rear end off, uh, waiting on it to warm up. But, uh, yeah, everything worked good. I will show you this, guys. This is some redneck ingenuity, but it actually ended up working out real well. So we had problems with it. It was getting like real high up on all of our stuff, sawdust. And uh, as you can see, it still blows over a little bit. But what I did was took a piece of this uh, um, wrapping that comes on uh, reels of fiber, and I just duct taped it to the side, made it to where it goes straight down, and now it lays it in a, in a row. But of course, there's some that blows away from it and everything. But this here, Makes it to where it goes in a nice neat row down through here and we can clean it up a lot faster. Makes it a lot easier. So that was a little redneck ingenuity, but we got it got her all done. We've got some windows in the barns, you can see. There's one back in there and there's two up there now because they're coming to build the hang barn. Uh, hopefully in the next few weeks and then we're gonna start siding it. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna make this a pretty long, lengthy video for you guys to watch because whenever I'm here, I'll do some update videos of what's going on. And, this next weekend we'll be running through some oak so i'll be definitely getting the oak on the video uh we're milling it up so anyhow please comment and subscribe catch y'all next one thank y'all for watching and uh stay tuned for the next few clips you're gonna see